Why did you get in a trap? I'm the tomboy of the family anyways. Ah! So, I mean, I've always been around outside hunting with my dad, and I just thought it was really, you know, it was kind of a really cool thing to do. Ah! The very first time I ever saw it, I was dove hunting with my dad, mm -hmm. and they had a big spool, had a trap on it that you pull with a string. Ah! But at the time, I mean, not knowing it, it was all like a man's sport, and there wasn't really a whole lot of women that had done it. So that was kind of a little bit more incentive for me to do it also, because you wasn't really supposed to. She's won everything there is to win, uh, many times over. She's, she's won titles that men haven't won. I end up doing, um, a lot of talking about her. She's she's a very modest champion. Ah! I just picked up on something. You say that thing's oscillating in there. Yes, it's oscillating in, inside the trap house, and you don't know really where the target's going to come. It's going away from you, but it's continuously it has interrupter in it, and it'll stop. Well, that makes things hard. It's harder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When you compare women to men, there's there's just not many sports that a woman can really compete equally um, with a man, and and Nora, of course, has done that and and superseded that. Ah! Tell us how many championships you've won and where. Seventy-five was my first Richard shoot. And up until now, probably the uh, the major championship, what they call the Grand American, I've won probably 150 plus for that. Wow. Okay. I saw a big honking ring that looks like it's from like an, you know, an NBA ring or something. This is kind of like the Super Bowl of trap shooting. It's which is kind of like what the ring is for. They give one of these away with whoever wins the singles, doubles, handicap, all around, which that consists of 400 targets. The overall is 1,000 targets. Ah! And the reason I got this was um, in doubles, like I said, there was two of us, and the other gentleman was uh, a guy from Colorado, Ray Stafford, which is probably known to be one of the best shooters, especially doubles that there is in the country. So he was kind of in like a no-win situation. He, if he won, he's supposed to. If, if I won, well, you know, it's a girl. So I mean, not only with the ring, but who I had to shoot off against it to win this. I'm the only woman that's ever won one of these, so that makes it even special, you know, to have this. Do you ever see these guys like, uh, like, man, I just, you know, are they pretty great? Well, I, I think, I think most men, if they, if they do lose to a woman, I, I think they have a little bit of embarrassment about that, but not this one. You know, if she beats them, it's understandable that, that they just shot against or beat or tied the best, you know, so it's, uh, she's, she's different than most ladies that shoot the game, you know, I mean, uh, she, she, I make it a regular practice. I don't, I don't worry about her beating me at all. It happens enough to where I'm, <laughs> I can handle it <laughs> really handle easy. It. Oh yeah. Now there's something over here that looks like a Stanley Cup, and it looks like it's old. That is the Francis and Clyde King Trophy. The lady that wins the high overall, like I said, that's a thousand targets combined, the singles, doubles, and handicap. If you win it five times, you get to retire it. Between the ring and that, that's probably the biggest things that I ever won. In 1999, I was inducted in Trap Shooting Hall of Fame to be the youngest to be in it also. And uh, that was a real, real honor for that. Annie Oakley's in that, which that's pretty cool that too. That is pretty cool. Ah! I had no idea. She's a champion's champion. When she lays the gun down for competition, does she do any outdoor stuff? She traps with me. Yeah, <laughs> she, uh, she's not quite ready to set her own trap line yet, but she's right there with me, you know, checking it all out. And, right. and uh, she loves the turkey hunt in the spring. I think that is her favorite thing to do. She's won everything there is to win. She competes against everybody. I always joke with her that she's got a, uh, a one-name name, uh, like Cher, and, you know, Sting, and then is Nora. Is Nora. Ah! 